Okay, so this question reads, six cars are to be arranged in a straight line and will be numbered one through six in order, from the front of the line to the back of the line. Each car is exactly one color. Two are green, two are orange, and two are purple. The arrangement of cars is restricted as follows. Okay, so we have basically a very strict set of inventory. We know how many of each color. So we have two green, two orange, and two purple. Okay, and we know we have this line from front to back of six cars. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six. It's always important just to remind yourself like where's the front and where's the back. I know it sounds silly, but a lot of times when you're in the middle of the game, you're not really sure like, okay, is the rightmost car the front or is the leftmost car the front? It's really important to just orientate yourself, all right? Okay, so let's go to rule number one. No car can be the same color as any car next to it in line. All right, so the way that I'm gonna depict this is just to show that, you know, if, it's, if color X is gonna be in the spot, then color X can't be next to it. Okay, we're gonna put an anti-block here. All right, now let's go to rule number two. Either car five or car six must be purple. So we know that if, car, if uh, the purple car is not in five, then the purple car will be in spot six. And contrapositive, if the purple car is not in spot six, then the purple car will be in spot five. Okay, so now let's go to rule number three. Car number one cannot be orange. All right, so we know that the orange car is not car number one. Let me put that over here as well. And we know rule number four, car four cannot be green. All right, so the green car not be the fourth car. Okay, so looking at rule number two, what this tells us is there has to be a purple car in five or in six. Okay, so it's not that they can be in both five and six, it's that it states either car five or car six must be purple, right? So one of them has to be purple. So the first thing that should come to your mind is, okay, either or, and it doesn't say but not both, right? But that kind of goes along with rule number one. We can't have purple be in car five, be car five and be car six because then two purples will be back to back with each other. But if you thought that for a second, good for you because if it doesn't say not both, either or can be both situations, right? Okay, so... You know there's going to be a scenario where car 5 is purple and another scenario where car 6 is purple. Okay, so there's a binary. So let's draw that out. In our first scenario, we're going to put car number 5 as the purple car. And then in the second scenario, that has all the same rules, we're going to put car 6 as purple. Alright, so let's look a little bit more into these deductions we can make. We've seen car number one can't be orange. So that means the only other colors that can be are green and purple, right? So we're gonna say green, purple, okay? Same with this bottom one. Now, in car number six, in the first scenario, it can't be purple, so that means the only two colors that can be are orange and green. And then in spot number four, again, the only colors that can be are orange and green because it can't be purple because it's next to a purple. But looking down here, it says it can't be green. So in this first scenario, number four, car number four has to be orange. All right, so now let's look at the second scenario. Likewise, in car five, it can only be orange green and then we know that the fourth car can't be green so the only colors the fourth car can be are orange or purple okay so we have these two scenarios now that we can look at all right now 
let's go ahead and hit the questions.